Hello and welcome to Azel Technologies. This is Ahmed and today we are going to learn how to embed a website into inside of your website or into your HTML pages. For this I'm just going to take my own website and this is the website that I want to be integrated in any other website. So let's say this. So what I have to do I'm just uh, flipping to Visual Studio I'm just going to right click here and add Oh, HTML page so here I'm writing MBD and just open it so here I have to use how I'm going to embed this I'm just going to use iframe so iframe src HTTP double colon forward slash www.azels.com and in this way I would be using this and I have to use here the frames so what I'm going to use it here like width I'm going to say this is going to be 100% and then I'm going to say height it will be approximately 560 pixels uh, so remove pixels 560 and save it so just run it you can see that my entire website is it's here it is here and I can just scroll down it and this is my website entire website is embedded here but there's a problem if you can find it out that you can see that there is a borderline and in the actual website there is no borderline so how we can remove that borderline here you have to just go and focus on frame border and that you have to put zero so as I would be putting frame border zero going to refresh you can see it you can notice right now there's a border and as I will refresh it the border is not now it has vanished so it's under person perfect you can go anywhere so inside of this and you can check out the URL here it is only your embedded so you are going and checking everything here but the thing is that it is not moving the URL is same it's not changing any page size because you are running in localhost you can even do that in your website even so if you want to integrate any third-party website outside and you don't want to show that what is the actual source or actual URL so you can do like this so thank you so much guys I hope so you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and if you have any question please write on the comment section I will definitely try to give the answer thank you so much guys have a nice day